Hello, good morning. Doing a song here again. T tomorrow, I'm sure all schools will be putting on the green and white, trying to celebrate Nigeria's independence. But the thing just came to my mind today that in the bid of celebrating independence, we need to ask ourselves some personal questions. As a school owner, the parent, a teenager or a child, you're celebrating independence for your country, which is Nigeria. Of course, if you're watching and you're not in Nigeria, Nigeria will be celebrating our independence October 1st, which is on a Sunday. And I'm sure across all schools in Nigeria, they'll be celebrating. But my question is that you should ask yourself as a school owner, are you an independent person? Are you raising independent teachers? And mothers, are you raising children that are independent? Are they solely dependent on you? Can they do little things by themselves? School owner, you should ask yourself, am I raising teachers that are independent? Independent teachers or member of staff are people you could actually trust that they will discharge their duty at every point in time so you don't need to keep putting it to them that i'm sure you can't do this i'm sure must i have must i be there with you all the time no raise independent staff school owners you cannot just um find you 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 need to check you need to supervise that that's one of what makes you a proactive school owner but raise teachers that are independent teachers that could think out of the box teachers that could discharge their duty effectively teachers that could pour out themselves in the children so if you're not raising independent member of staff you need to start that training or you need to start thinking of what to do to raise independent staff so can your business thrive when you're not around if your answer is no you haven't started because you will not be there all the time have you raised trusted hands have you put structures in place that could help you to ensure that your organization is running successfully so school owners, as you're celebrating independence, think about that. For teachers, are you independent? If your job stops today, would you be able to feed? In other words, you need to think out of the box. You need to get other means of income. Fine, your extra tutorial classes that you do after school is okay, but I feel it's more stressful. Teachers are doing other things. What do you have passion for? Your passion can bring more. Your passion can bring money into your account and food on your table. Many teachers are going into online classes. Now ask yourself, do can you even operate? um the platforms the online platforms for teaching then as you're celebrating independence you need to think and also this time next year you'll be celebrating your own independence too from financial bankruptcy downturn or financial stress and to you mothers our fathers are you raising independent children your toddler can he or she do little things by themselves you need to start asking yourself that question can your toddler do things by themselves are they dependent on you solely all the time good morning are they dependent solely on you all the time if the answer is yes then you can't be celebrating independent day 100 percent fine nigeria is celebrating but you also need to celebrate teenagers are you are you independent can you do things yourself can you prepare your meals can you go to the market yourself can you study yourself parents we need to ask ourselves these questions your children especially when they are from age four they should be able to do their assignments by themselves you don't need to be the one to tell them. They need to know when to do the assignment, where to keep their bag, what they need to do per time when they come back from school, when they wake up in the morning, how to keep their clothes in the wardrobe. Then you're raising independent children. So sit down and think, like, what am I doing that I'm totally dependent on another person? You're not a parasite. So you shouldn't be dependent totally on someone. So as we celebrate Independence Day, celebrate your own independence too. So happy Independence Day, Nigeria. Tomorrow, put on your white, put on your green. No matter what's happening in our nation, we still have to celebrate. Thank you for listening. Thank you for being here with me on this channel. 
I can't do all this without you. Thank you for the comment. Thank you for the works of encouragement. Sometimes, you know, we are humans. We have emotions and might be discouraged. But your good, I mean, your good, your good compliment has been keeping me going. And for the constructive criticism, yes, we'll get better as time goes on. If you have you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do that on YouTube, Eson Oluwatoyi. You can also follow me on Facebook. And um, on TikTok, it's still Eson Uluwa 24 on TikTok. So see you next time. Be good. Stay independent. Bye.